yep, Wednesday, middle of the week. So I have decided to do Diverse Capitals again. And if you're like, y'all do what the fuck, why are we doing this one again? I could always be like, if you do have suggestions for maps you would like me to try, uh, go ahead and put them in the comments below, and I will definitely look at them and do them. There have been a few people who have done many requests, and I'm always happy to oblige. I mean, I'm not being like, choose, give me new maps, or I'm just going to keep doing these ones, but I got a little sequence going now. I've just stayed on Monday. Um, conveniently, someone was graceful enough to give me a... This is Paris. I mean, it's pretty definitive. If anybody, I've been grateful that someone has been willing to uh, give me a map to do on Friday. So I've been doing that. And uh, it's a pretty good setup right now. The Two Maggots. That's a very fancy restaurant. But hey, I'm here for you. And hopefully. You enjoy it, and I still thank you for your support, continued viewing, and along those lines, I hope you are enjoying the uh, insane dump I just somehow spontaneously decided to do. That is a tall building. Um, this week of, I know I did six at the time, but I'm going to have to do one more later, uh, it, it'll be seven videos of... Battletech. I mean, I did not plan on doing that, but it kind of just turned out that I did one, I did another one, and I was like, I'll do one more, and then that one had a thing after that, and then I was like, oh, kind of feel like just doing it. I had some time on Sunday to do it all, and instead of just being like, well, I can do this, and then not be able to do any uh, thing else with, for, for that show, or that game for price I put two out a week, that's another month's worth of thing, and while that's economical, I'm like, no, I want to play this game. And I do have two uh, saves going. I've got one <clears throat> that is the YouTube, and I have another one that is just me on the other side. I mean, I'm not really, like, doing the offline one to get me a little knowledge. I mean, in a way it is, too, but I've also failed that one. Um, I ended up going into a mission a little too tough. And I kept with the basic mechs a little too long. Those are some pronounced nipples on that guy. Oh, this was not too long ago, huh? San Andreas. What a movie. Never saw it. But anyway, I'm... I like that. I'm surprised I'm liking it as much as I am. I had the game for a long time, and then I was just played it for a while, and I'm just like, eh. But I think I kind of like the, the setup of the uh, career mode in that. Not so much the, uh, um, I think we're going to, hmm. I don't know if we're actually in this part or if we're around it, but I'm playing it safe here, and I'm just going to pick a place around here. But I kind of like the setup of you just do the career, you do it for a while, and then when you're done, it's it's kind of it. You know, it's kind of like a roguelike. Roguelike? But, yeah, um, sum that up. I'll be doing that this week if I'm going to do it again for another, uh, this is the Isle of France, huh? Maybe we're here. I don't, I don't think so. So, um, if I end up doing oops another week's worth, you'll see the comment on Facebook. That's where I'm going to be doing it. I mean, I could do it on Twitter, but I don't even know if I remember the, uh, I was closer on my first guess. I just clicked away. I don't even know if I have it. Well, this is Tokyo. If I have the Twitter account on there. I mean, it, it mainly was just for sharing videos when YouTube had that option to link your Twitter, but they get they got rid of that whenever that um stopped showing up to Twitter. You can go back and look, and it was like, okay, they stopped doing it then. What do we got? Yamamuraclinic.com. Is that a cat? Like a stethoscope. Either way, I couldn't tell you. Um, so, yeah, now that's out of the way, how we doing? 
I babbled on for a while there. I mean, I do that. <clears throat> it's kind of what the whole point of this channel is with some geoguessing in the midst. I hope you are having a good week. It's the first week of the last month of the last year of the decade. I mean, there there has been that talk of past 10 years reflecting on that and um I kind of did that and I used to have this game when I was playing um right when I was around high school where I'm like man if me 10 years from now were to come back and tell me now that I'd be fine because it was always just like I'll figure this out eventually I'll surely do it in 10 years well these are some very cute alligators um 10 years after I graduated uh, high school, nope, didn't figure it out. Ten years after that, still really didn't figure it out. I mean, it really wasn't until maybe last year that I felt okay. Maybe the year before. I, I think it really was last year when I actually did get, end up getting this new job I have now. That a lot of the stress I had, I kind of don't have anymore. Um, I'm not really bragging i'm just ob observing and i know that um yeah it, 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 i don't want to say money's the root of all evil or money can't buy happiness but when you stress out about money and not having enough and all that other stuff you very that's a is that mickey mouse weird when you stress out about money for decades on end then you finally kind of get a reprieve from it it does at least buy a temporary um Relax, joy, tenseness is, is released. I mean, I'm sure at some point, uh, as it happens with most things, like, okay, you get a new job. It's like, holy shit, I'm making all this money. What am I going to do with all this? It's amazing. It's fantastic. This job is way better than my last one. Um, you eventually start increasing the amount that um, you spend. You know, you, your, your, your cost of living slowly gets bumped up and adjusts to what you make now and you kind of end up hitting that ceiling again like you did before you're like ah oh, geez you know i was doing so well um and now i got all these bills and uh, you just keep running out of money it's like if i had a little bit more money i'd just be fine and then the the loop happens again i mean i'm sure there's people that are like no i'm fine i love what i do my job's great um i'm not just financially rewarded i'm very much at peace with what I do. I find joy in all the things that I do. I'm really in a good place, that type of stuff. And I guess I kind of have to say, this has been a pretty good year. I mean, the decade, 10 years ago from now. Um, I think, man, my phone is going nuts. 80% of the last uh, 10 years, really nothing happened. So... I think I did I did click Tokyo, so I'm gonna say we're oh I didn't get a chance to click. Nice. Um I didn't Oh I did. Anyway, this is a I've noticed with these they seem to be granted this is only two in a row. Is this another European? Let's see what this says. Uh we got multiple flags here. This is Brussels. Yep. Festival of Formation. Interesting. Where is Brussels, huh? <laughs> let's let's get a little bigger here. I can say we're like here. Brussels Formation. Let's is that an actual name? Palais de Brussels? Maybe we're here? No, that, that looks like a park. Maybe we're there. No. Let's, let's circle around here. That is a large building. All of these are. You go to a road that goes underground. That doesn't help me. I mean, I got, I did click. Yes, I did. Okay. I clicked the capital at least. But I guess if I had any advice, and I mean, all all advice really is, is just really personal experience. And I've been in line for a couple decades now. 
I'm not going to say it always gets better, but I'm like, hey, just keep plugging away. Not everybody finds what they want immediately. It mean, takes some time. I'm not much different. Maybe you figured out what you did as soon as you, as soon as you were like, all right, I want this, and it just worked out. I mean, I'm sure if I talk to 15-year-old me that was like, no, I'm going to be a the fuck did a microbiologist i was like oh that's that's exactly what i want to do and then two years later i'm like the fuck are you talking about you're an idiot very much like 10 years ago i knew what i wanted to do and i was like well i'm gonna be stuck doing this because i'm just trapped it was it was a very helpless feeling of just like i make just enough that i can barely make by but trying to find another job it's been impossible and most other things introductory stuff is it significant enough pay cut where I would just feel like I can't afford it and you feel trapped but you, you you keep plugging along that's that's all I can say I mean that's all you're going to do like it or not you're gonna be alive you're gonna keep doing things and you will figure it out everyone does and if you already had hey you're ahead of the curve and I'm not be like a threat and it's like you may have figured it out now, but maybe you won't in three years and something else you're doing is like, oh shit, this is amazing. Is that a Union Jack hard hat? On uh, no it's not. Okay. Ugh. What the fuck did I get here? Anyway, mostly this is just because, hey, I did kind of pick of a easy one to do, but also I'm kinda feeling a little Ah, relaxed a bit. I mean, I I got the, I got the I got the, the the city right. I hit gas and I I got it. Oh, it was near the Bruxelles Madu. How do you do? This is Tokyo again. I think this is Tokyo again. You know this had ten thousand images on this diverse capitals, and it it, it kind of is a bit annoying that it seems to be Europe. Or friggin' Tokyo, but that's random for you. You're you're only as random as random can be, and that can very well be the same uh, same place multiple times. Uh, I do remember there was a uh, book when I was in college, and they talked about randomness as a concept. And there was an actual before there was like random number generators on the internet, a book. That was just filled with pages and pages and pages. I forget how many. I think it was like hundreds maybe. And it was just a list of numbers. I forget the actual like, okay, here's a list of random numbers between X and Y. Or maybe like 1 and 100. And I don't know. I think what it did was um, for that entire page, it was like, okay, pick random numbers between 1 and 100 a thousand times. And then it just printed it out on a sheet of paper. So if you ever were like truly trying to do something random, you would just open this book up, cross off, you know, however many numbers you needed to finish that random set, and then just move on to the next one. It was really strange how, like, okay, I'm going to pick random numbers out of your head, but you're really not, because when you think about picking random numbers, you're like, all right, I'm going to pick one between 1 and 10. i got to pick one on either end. Like, i got to pick one close to 1, i got to pick one close to 10, and maybe a few in the middle, but you really kind of have a biased cordial taxi is this a what look at those those are some fancy side view mirrors oh he's got a glove on oh that is a european car this is not hong kong is it no it's not oh wait a minute why is everybody driving like a european now now I'm concerned, and I probably have zero reason to be overthinking this. I'm pretty sure of it. Get the Santoku. I want to get one of those knives. I need to finish off my kitchen accessories. Man, even your garbage trucks are very cute. <laughs> Uh, is this, I'm just like looking for a bit further confirmation that this is Tokyo, even though I'm like 99% sure. But the problem is that 1% feels like 40%. And I'm concerned. 
because all of these are driving on that side. Man, I'm. Am I? Am I actually gonna? Am I gonna do this? No, this is. Is this Hong Kong? This can't be Hong Kong. Anytime fit. That's JP. Yeah, see, it's dot JP. All right, thank you. Why do you all drive on that side? I am, hmm, unless we're like down here, but I, we're not in Okinawa, are we? No, 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 no. Why are you all driving this side? Am I, am I just being dumb now? I don't think I am. You know, I think I've added too much extra unnecessary drama to this when it really isn't that big of a deal. But I'm going to find out in three seconds how dumb I am and whether or not my instincts were okay. That is weird that they were all on that side of the road. I mean, has it always been that? I've just not noticed. Hello, Southeast Asia. We're in India or we're like here. One of these countries. Are we in New Delhi? Oh, I almost thought this was a dome. Oh, well, we got peacocks. Hmm. This is a new hospital. And we've got some very golden peacocks here. They make weird noises if you've never heard a peacock. Just Google it. It's weird. All right. Let's see what this... Uh, but, whoa. I don't want to be here. This billboard. I gotta hit home. How the fuck did I end up here? Alright, turn around. Bright eyes. Every now and then I fall apart. Alright, yeah, we, we got through it. Mainly it's me. Hmm. Golden. I don't know. Bangladesh International Gateway Limited. So I guess we're in, uh, Dhaka? Or Chittagong? No, Dhaka's the capital. Is this the high? I mean, it's Bangladesh. Let's see, we've got something army. Doesn't help me. What are you doing? Bagging up dirt? It's a very fancy hospital here. Interesting um, defense over your windows there. Some very tall billboards here. What is this for? 3G? Teletalk 3G. Kenny Rogers Roasters. Weird. Kenny Rogers has a restaurant and it's in Bangladesh. Could this be? This has to be Bangladesh. Yeah, Doc BD. Less fat, less salt, less calories now open. What a weird... What What is... Is this like supposed to be root beer flow? That looks like tea. You got some steak. Although, wait. No, it's chicken. Okay, I was going to say, if that's steak, I'm pretty sure they don't... They, they, they don't like it when you kill cows. I mean, I know it's an India thing. I'm pretty sure it's also a thing for Bangladesh as well. Joining the Bangladesh Army. I guess they don't have um, mandatory, uh, what is it called? Service? I always wondered about that if I would have been okay with it. Granted, I'm sure if I grew up in the country, I would have just been like, yeah, because that's what everyone does. But I wonder if I actually would have been okay with it. I don't like... I mean, I, I had the thought of joining the military at some point. Army Golf Club, we're going. Get me in there. Why can't I go? Army Golf Club. <clears throat> let's, let's zoom in here. I got 30 seconds. I'm going to assume it is, and I'm clicking there, near the Tin Shed Colony. If it's not there, it could be the high-tech multi-care hospital. It, hmm. Army Golf Club. Oh, shit. 
here. No, we were. Um. Okay, it was there. I did come across the golf. Oh man, I was off a bit there in the Zia colony. Okay. Well, that was a pretty strong. What are you going to do? It was two Tokyos in a row. That was kind of easy, but I wanted to take a relaxing little mental meandering, and I hope that you appreciated it. Once again, I'd like to thank you all for watching. If you do have any comments, questions, search, complaints, suggestions for maps or anything else, please, please leave them in the comments below. Um, go check out the Battletech series. Let me know what you think. Um, anything else on your mind? It'll be going seven days this week, so check it at your leisure. But if not, we'll uh, see you back here on Friday for a bit more. Guessing Geography. Have a good one.